Right, Golf Shop Onliners, next time you're practicing and you want to get better at taking your practice game out onto the course, let's get you practicing some variation. So there's a drive lot. I've just hit my driver. And where there's time to do block practice, so over and over again, let's say I've done a good amount of block practice, but I just want to see how my practice is going if I went out and played. So just hit my driver. Next shot I'm going to hit is with my 52. And let's say I'm going to go 100 yards or try to go 100 yards. And obviously you could do this on a practice area with targets. I'm using a launch monitor here. That one's gone 98 yards with a little bit of roll, so a little bit short. But practicing the variation between going from a longer club to a shorter club, let's have different stances, slightly different setups, different strike points, can be huge for A, showing you where your holes are, so in your game, so you're not very good at going from a driver to a wedge, like you can't adjust. I see people struggle to adjust when they do lots of block practice. Good players, I don't. See, like, you're really low handicappers. I don't see this as an issue, but kind of 10 handicap upwards, certainly to the higher handicappers and any new golfers out there, this is a huge issue. They get so into block that they get out onto the kind of irregular golf course where you're hitting so many different shots, and it's too puzzling. Before I went out and played, I mean, this is an eight iron. I would practice a few shots with an eight iron just chipping it low and forwards out in front of me, how straight I could get it. So that one's going about 75, 80 yards. I'm probably going to play that shot today. When I play, there's going to be a chip out from under a tree or a decent drive that's on the right side and it's under a tree and I have to run it forwards. Or I have to do it with a six iron or an eight iron or a wedge even. So not having played that shot in a long time isn't helping me get out on the course. When you get out on the course, you're going to be presented with variation. Tee shots, wedge shots, chip shots, flop shots, low ones, medium irons, long irons. Practice that variation. Take your variation game to the range. Do your amount of block practice, so over and over again, drilling whatever you want to get to feel. Once you feel you've made some progress, or at least every practice session, you should try a little bit of randomization. It'll really help you transform your on the range game onto the course.